my little party animals. Hip Hip Renee here, and today we're going to talk about three items in The Sims 4 that I love, but in the past I've struggled to find good ways of using these items. The bay window seats, the wall cabinets from Island Living, and the open shower from Discover University. If you want to see some fun ways of using these items, then stick around. First up is the bay window seats. Number one, use it in a bay window. The main way to use a bay window seat is, of course, as a bay window seat. These seats fit snugly into bay windows and give you the bonus of making the exterior of your houses just a little more interesting. You can even play with move objects and add things like flowers or books to the shelves behind the seats. Number two, in the corner of a living room. While these seats are made for bay windows, you can also stick them in the corner of a living room. By placing them in the corner, you leave a space behind them which can perfectly fit a tall plant, a lamp, or some other items if you're playing around and you're feeling creative. Number three, in the garden. The stone version of this bench looks particularly good outside. You can back up flowers and bushes to the bench to make it look like it's part of the landscape. It'll give your Sims the perfect, relaxing place to sit while outside. Next up, we have the Island Living Cabinets. Number one, in the kitchen. Again, this is obvious. But with these cabinets not immediately resembling the style of other cabinets we have in game, it's easy to get frustrated and not want to use them. If you play around with move objects, you can intersect the cabinets and make them fit in almost any space. Create new shapes and play around with different heights to create a unique kitchen all your own. Number two, in the bathroom or laundry area. While the laundry day shelves are great, they are definitely a certain style. If you're into building modern homes, like me, just kidding, you may find that the laundry day shelves don't fit in with your builds, but you still want shelving in your bathroom or laundry areas. The island living cabinets are much more sleek and modern looking and can elevate the look of any build. Number three, as a TV console. This is my personal favorite way of using the Island Living Cabinets. With a little move objects magic and some messing around, you can create some really cool looking TV console areas. Try placing these cabinets in all sorts of various ways and you're sure to come up with a unique configuration. And finally, there's the Discover University Shower. Number one, a single tile shower with a window. Ever since I started doing more shell challenges, I've seen more and more creative uses of this Discover University shower. One of the simplest and nicest looking in my opinion is simply placing a wall next to the shower and adding a window to close it in. It makes the shower feel less like a prison shower and more homey and done up. Number two, an outdoor shower at the beach. Island Living came with the beach world of Sulani, and even Brindleton Bay is a little beachy based from being based on New England. But the outdoor shower from Island Living is very stylized. Since the Discover University shower is a bit more on the neutral looking side, you can really dress it up to create a gorgeous outdoor shower. Number three, his and hers shower. If you've ever wanted your Sims to just have a massive, fuck-off style shower, you are in luck with Discover University. By using a larger-than-average bathroom space, you can easily create a beautiful his and her shower with all sorts of fun details. I can't wait to see what you all come up with using these tips and tricks. If you use any of them, feel free to tag me on Twitter or Instagram. I would love to see what you come up with. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.